we're fixing to extract our first honey. Excited? Yes. These cats will follow us all over. They respect the bees, they're staying back here with me. Now with this hive, that top box is completely full of honey. And so what he's going to do is take those frames out. So this is one short frame. It's fully capped with honey. And we're gonna weigh it. So four pounds and 2.6 ounces. That's cool. This is not a heated knife. This is a home knife. We're just messing with. We don't know what we're doing. Here, try this. I see people use these things. That works pretty good, huh? I guess. You have to push hard, or is it going in easy? Push hard on some of this. Get this over here now. I was just talking, I said it's just gonna sit in there like this. I guess the uh, downside about this is the wax cappings will go in the wax and the honey with it, right? <laughs> yeah, I think the knife uh, would have kept those away from it, <clears throat> but I don't know. So we tried the knife. That didn't work out so well. It's I, probably too dull or the wax is just too pliable or something. So we tried that roller, that worked pretty good. Now he's trying to fork. What do you think about that? Better? Uh, I don't know. Depends on what we're trying to do here. We're trying to save the comb. We don't want to destroy his right. least amount of work for him. I don't know what that would be really. The knife works good if you had the right knife. You just take the top off right there. Mm -hmm. like that. Mm -hmm. Well, we can get one of those heated knives, you know, that's what they usually use, and it literally melts through the wax. But we want to keep 
keep that wax stuff. Uh, when we're done with this, we can filter it and get a little bit more honey, but then we'll also have uh, wax uh, for our own use. the other side. I like the roller thing the best. I like this knife if you have a good knife. Yeah. Well you need a heated one probably. this huh? huh they did this good job with this oh we got a few more weevils than we need i think oh yeah 
coconut screen netting on the bottom of the boxes. Is that? No, I think we just did that. So the average per frame for the short frame is about four pounds, right? It's pretty good. I mean, we want to get four pounds of honey uh, because, you know, the frame and the wax weighs most of that, but... I can definitely see why the She's not with us. <laughs> but she knows she can't come in this building. So how many, uh, for the first extractor, uh, how many frames do you want to buy for? This is a fourth frame, but it holds eight shorts. Is that the kind you want to get for the first time, or you want to do the smaller ones? If we still have intentions of expanding, it would only, you know, we don't want to do any smaller. All right. Is it loaded? Oh, man. Yeah. Oh, bummer. <laughs> well, it's not too much. cardboard down and there's sticky spots on the floor so we don't step in it and then track it all over like we did. Stuff. I know. That is better than anything we've got so far. Got clear. So clear. This is what? It's the San Mateo, Florida honey. Melon, melon Mm-hmm. Wow, that's good stuff. It is good. I think it's better than the orange I, I kind of think it has a, a it may have entrance. Some a citrus taste to it, it to it may me. Maybe our orange tree. Yeah, I think the orange bloom got into this batch. Mm. That's good. Good, good. All right. All right. So he's 
unscrew that, which will disengage the, the spinning. All right, here we go. Yeah. Trying it out for the first time. right now uh, to bottle up our honey that we harvested from our own hives. Uh, we let it set overnight. Um, it should be ready to all of the excess wet or honey that didn't spin out should have drained out by now. So we should be ready to filter this and, and bottle it. that color is. Ooh, that's not trashy at all either. Okay, so the white stuff that you see in there is the wax. That's uh, the cappings that we cut off. So this filter here will um, strain that for us. Okay. All right. So we're weighing our first load of honey from one small hive or short hive. What do you call those? Short? Uh, it's too heavy. Huh? Might be too heavy. Alright now let's see if you can you can go past the line if you want a little bit. Uh, I guess it only goes up to 25 pounds, so that's got to be more than 25 pounds. Okay, here we go. Thank you, Lord, for this bountiful harvest you provided. <clears throat> got the bottle weight uh, on it, so it'll zero out the bottle weight. 7.9. Got it. Those are eight ounce jars. It's pretty close. So this is the 
this is where we're going to end the video and let you look at this beautiful honey that we extracted here on our own farm. We hope you enjoyed this video and if you haven't subscribed, please subscribe and uh, hit the like button for us. And the best way you can help us here at our farm is to share our videos on your social media. We appreciate it. And thank you, and God bless you until next time. Bye-bye.